Today, we'll be demonstrating how to wire a Monroe start box. Before you begin this project, be sure that your breaker is turned off. For the purpose of this demonstration, we've already pre-run power wires from the breaker box, wires out of the pump motor, and the master valve circuit into the box. So step one, let's review the wiring diagram. Line one and line two is the power supply coming from the breaker box, continuing the power to the motor. The grounding wires and master valve circuits are all displayed here and staged within the box. Step two, twist your two ground wires together. One comes from the breaker box and one from the motor. Now, slide both of the grounding wires into the grounding lug and tighten. This is the safe path of electricity to go to the ground. Step three, loosen the bottom T1 and T2 terminal screws on the contactor. The black and white wires will be your two hot leads at 220 volts running to the pump motor. In the case of 110 volt, these wires are hot and neutral. Tighten the terminal screws. Now note, with anything electrical, make sure your connections are good and tight. Loose connections can both be dangerous and also reduce the longevity of your control box due to possible arcing and burning of the contact terminal. Now step four, loosen the top L1 and the L2 terminal screws on the contactor and secure the black and white wires coming from the breaker box. Make sure if you are using fork connectors, the spades are behind the cover plate and tighten the screws. Now to avoid confusion, it is always a good idea to color match the power leads which are attached to both the top and the bottom of the contactor. Step 5. You're ready to connect the master valve circuit. Attach the pre-wired master valve and common leads coming off the contactor to the appropriate wire coming from the lawn controller. The wire nut is supplied for convenience. Now note, always make sure to cut the insulation away from the wire end before installation. Once finished, tuck the wires neatly into the box and out of the way. We're going to put our cover back on the start box, secure with the single screw supplied, and we are finished. Thank you.